Hey guys, welcome to my channel! <laughs> this is the Twin Flames Collective Reading. Happy Friday. Is it Friday? Yes, it sure is. It's Friday. <sighs> you know, I just feel so good. Guys, I get out of bed every day, and the first thing is I stretch my arms out. I'm, I haven't even gotten out of bed. I just wake up and I'm laying there, right? Laying in bed, just wake up, and I stretch my arms out, and I go, ah, satisfied, ah, right? Can you, can you picture that? My arms going up into the air, ah. Gosh darn it, I'm so happy to be alive. Now, how is this possible? You guys might be sitting there and you're thinking, I'm not, see, I'm not trying to make you jealous. I'm just gonna tell you how I do it, right? Because I want you to be that happy. So, you might be sitting there thinking, Kurt, I feel like crap. <laughs> and the, this person, my twin flame, I cannot stop thinking shit. Let's just pause right there for one second. Let's just acknowledge the obsessive thinking with your twin flame. Holy hell. Oh my God, dude. Are you fucking kidding me right now? I just, it, whoa. It's like it's happening to you. It's like it's happening to you. Jeez Louise, man. It's intense, man. The obsessive thing. You cannot turn it off. It's like it's happening to you. The obsessive thinking with your twin flame, it is, uh, I mean, wow. It, oh my God, guys, the obsessive thinking, it's just, it's insane. It's, I can't even right now, you know what I'm saying? It, I, uh, uh. So, let's just get that out of the way right now. It's so intense, guys. It's like, you, I can't even describe it. It's just, Anybody that hasn't ever experienced the obsessive thinking, for me to describe it to you, it's like, just, you know, I don't know. I don't know, man. I, I don't know. <laughs> How do you describe that? How do you describe that? Now, why that's happening? Why is that happening? Well, it's, I guess, what you would call a metaphysical activation. I don't like that word, activation, simply because it's kind of along the lines of that, like, cringy style of, like, New Age spiritualism, which isn't spiritual. It's a religion. That's really what's going on. All right? It's a religion. And, uh... I don't have anything against religion in general, but uh, that's, I mean, that's, that's what's going on. So new age. And uh, they always are saying things like that, like, oh my God, spiritual activation. I got my crystals. I'm doing the energy activation. Oh, I'm going through the energy portal. Oh my God. It's 11-11. Oh my God. Right. And uh, I don't know, guys, that just... Uh, I don't want to say anything bad. I, you know, I don't want to dog them too much, but it, I don't know. Come on. Come on. That stuff's cringe, bro. It's cringe. Straight up. And you don't even need that stuff. You don't even need that stuff, dude. Now, some of that stuff is real. Like, I've got all these crystals and tarot cards and yeah. But without the consciousness behind it, it doesn't really do anything for you. And that's what this channel is all about is, wait a minute. You can do all that stuff, healing and energy clearings and all these things, fine. But first, remember who you are. And that's what this twin flame business is really all about. Now that I got that out of the way, a couple of tangents there. The energy activation, the metaphysical activation. Yeah, that really is kind of the best word for that. I'm gonna fix my little feather here. Let's kind of make it pretty. So when you meet your twin flame, what's going on? It's you in another body. There's two of you. Wait, there's two of me? That's right. The question is, who are you? What is you? What is the self? Well, you are a soul. The soul is consciousness. The mind is thoughts. 
emotions, right? Thoughts, emotions. Okay, it's metaphysical, it's mental, it's emotional. It works on duality. And the personality, the ego personality, it, the mind, the separate self, as it has been called for a long, long time in ancient Zen spiritualism, that's really where that word separation comes from, by the way. It's not really a twin flame terminology. I've made a video about that. Go to my home page. If you really want to know what Twin Flames are all about, go to my homepage and it's right there at the top. Um, it's Twin Flames, Separation Consciousness, Unity Consciousness, and Detaching Unity Consciousness, Union. Your Twin Flame is inside you, guys. And the fact is, what is inside you? Consciousness, which is who you really are at your core. Okay. Now, the soul, the consciousness explodes when you meet them. It's a simultaneous incarnation of your soul. You, you, I call them, like my coaching students, I tell them it's your other self. It's your other self. You are simultaneous incarnations. There's two incarnations, right? Like past lives, reincarnation. You know what I'm saying? You, this is why I'm saying, this is why I'm the world's leading twin flame coach. And I'm not saying that to toot my own horn. But gosh, just look at the numbers, dude. Almost 6,000 students. That's a lot of people, dude. Now, how did I do it? Not by reinventing the wheel. Not by, you don't need to reinvent the wheel. You don't need the new age stuff, right? All you need is, the, it's really old age spiritualism. Actual, genuine, authentic spiritualism. Transcendentalism, basically, you are not your mind. You are not the personality. You're not the separate self. You're not the ego. We're not saying that that's bad, the separate self. It can be a lot of fun. So now I'm going to bring this talk full circle. It can be a lot of fun if you remember who you are first. You are consciousness. You are the soul. That's your twin flame. So this activation causes the breakdown of the energy clump, <laughs> called the ego personality, the separate self, the ego personality. It's the mind, mental, emotional, metaphysical, right? And uh, yeah, it's really fucking painful. <laughs> oh shit, there's the obsessive thinking, there's the desperation, there's the sense of meaninglessness that you're feeling about your twin flame. And it's horrible. Oh my God, I spent six months on the floor crying and bawling. Me, I did that, guys. I went through the same shit you went through. And now I get out of bed every day and I'm like, ah. Because all I had to do was take my focus off the person and go inside, remember who I am. I am the consciousness, right? That's who I am. That's what me is. And instantly I felt better. All of these blessings came in. And guess what else happened? My twin flame started chasing me like the dickens. Doesn't that sound nice? Right. That sounds super nice. Okay, guys. Here we go at the bottom of the deck. We have the... Hold on. Just gonna... It's the eight of... It's the eight of wands. I'm just kind of getting it nice and neat for you guys. All right. Eight of wands at the bottom of the deck. So... There's going to be changes, and they're coming in fast, guys. It's like Divine Masculine is coming in for a landing, I guess you could say. Eight of Wands, it, there's no real narrative attached to that card, right? It's not really um, telling you a specific event or about a person. It's just energy, right? It's just energy, the Eight of Wands. It's telling you, yeah, there's changes coming, and they're happening fast, you're, it's and fast. Fast is a relative term, and I and uh, you might not know all the answers. That's why the chariot is at the center of the reading for your connecting energy with your so-called divine masculine, your twin flame, right? And uh, if you're new here, by the way, welcome. My name's Kurt. I am what you call divine feminine. And the labels, the gender labels, that's not really how it works. Those are just pointing you at a deeper underlying concept called duality, like yin, yang, divine masculine, divine feminine. Some people, they get really stuck on those labels. Just let them go, guys. It's just energy. It's just energy. But ordinarily, 
if you're the one that's sitting here on YouTube, watching these tarot readings, looking at twin flame information, that's what people call divine feminine. Um, but don't worry about it. It's just, you could say positive and then your DM is negative or anode cathode or alpha omega. Just, just, just go with it. All right. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So my twin flame is a woman who is divine masculine. Now you guys are going forward. Obviously that's why the chariot is coming out right now and changes are going to happen fast. Um, now where are we going? I will tell you specifics about where we're headed here, right? Where this shit is going. But the thing about the chariot, here's what I'm trying to emphasize right now. I'm missing my words. Sorry about that. The thing about the chariot is, no, this is going to be positive. This is going to be great. It's going to be fantastic. Just go with it. That's kind of the message of the chariot. We're moving forward. Don't know where we're going. Not clear about all the answers, but we're going. Let's go. And if you just go, it'll be fine. That's the chariot. Chariot's a great card, guys. And by the way, it's Major Arcana number seven. That's a great number, guys. Number seven. Now, the Eight of Wands, quick changes, fast changes, things happening fast. Again, quickly, in quotation marks, it's kind of relative because um, the way that 3D reality works, it's density, it's slow, it's clunky 3D reality, right? So quick changes could be a month. It could be two weeks. It could be four months if you resist. <laughs> if you don't know all the answers and you're like, I don't know all the answers. That's making me uncomfortable. I don't want to do it. You resist, right? Then it takes longer. So just don't resist. Just surrender and everything will be fine. This is an interesting pairing right here. So, okay. So we got the tower and the moon, the great mystery, the moon in the subconscious for Divine Masculine, recent past, and the tower. So again, even Divine Masculine is asking questions. What does this mean to me? Where am I going? I don't understand my situation. Why this shit's falling apart? And they don't really need to understand. They're just kind of really done with uh, limiting themselves, so-called Divine Masculine, and their situation. Karmic situation could be a job, could be a relationship, husband, wife, uh, boyfriend, girlfriend, uh, could be family, you know, whatever it is, right? But that shit's not going anywhere. This is actually like negative energy pulling back. Okay, I'm kind of done. I'm moving away. Uh, Divine Masculine really tearing the shit down. And again, I always tell you guys this. They could be shit posting on social media about how fucking ass great their life is. No, guys, everybody does that. Not everybody. I don't do that, but a lot of people do. They're, oh, yeah, look at me. My life is awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, dude. So let's just get that out of the way right now. They're not being honest with you. Maybe they are, right? But a lot of you watching, I see you in the comments and you're talking about, yeah, well, my twin flames seems like they're having a good time. Mm, yeah, I don't know about that, dude. I don't know about, I call that shit posting divine feminine. And I think you know that. That's why this page of cups is coming out in your subconscious. <clears throat> you know, everything is not what it seems. And it's time to think outside the box a little bit. Right? It's like you're having a sub it's like you're having a conversation with your subconscious. That's a little bit of what the page of cups can represent. So quick changes. Again, quick is a relative term that could be two weeks, five weeks. You know, just go with it, guys. Don't resist. And the thing is, in the grand scheme of thing, things, is a month really that long? Two months? Is that really that much time? Guys, just focus on your shit and your twin flame, they'll just come in. They just do. Remember what I said at the beginning. If you skipped the intro to this video, if you're new here and you skipped the intro, naughty, 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 naughty. I'm the world's leading twin flame coach, guys, just in numbers alone, almost 6,000 students. I'm not saying that to brag, but uh, maybe I know a thing or two about this. I'm just saying, I'm just saying I am different. When you listen to how I explain this stuff, you're like, wait a minute, this makes sense. This is different. At least that's what everybody tells me. And I know I'm different, you know, I'm not saying that I'm better than anybody else, but I am, I am different. I am. So go check out the intro to this video. It's free coaching guys. Like this tarot card reading is cool and everything. We're going to tell you what will happen, but I think what's better is to know how to make it happen. Remember you are your twin flame. You are simultaneous incarnations of the same soul, right? You're one soul. 
you're simultaneous incarnations of the same soul. So go check out the intro if you skipped it. If you're new here, free coaching, guys. Uh, and uh, it'll make your life so much better, guys. All you got to do is remember who you are. You are the consciousness. And I think you're kind of primed to do that. Look at this. Divine feminine justice next to the devil in reverse. Right. So this is this cause and effect. You're going to be made to detach from this person. That's the whole idea. The soul knows what it's doing. The higher self in heaven, it's coordinating all this shit for you, right? It's coordinating everything. All you got to do is just go with it and stop resisting these changes. And I know the, I know the changes hurt, <laughs> but it's necessary so that you can get out of bed every day and go, ah, just like I do, guys. This is your spiritual ascension, and that's all you need to worry about. You just focus on that, remembering who you are. You are consciousness. The soul is consciousness. Remember, body, mind, soul. You just have to know how these things work. The body, we're pretty clear how that works. What's interesting is the body is duality too. Our 3D physical reality is rooted in duality. Even Albert Einstein had a word for it. He called it relativity, things being relative. So even the atoms in your body are Positive protons, negative electrons, and there's even neutral neutrons, right, in the middle. But it's a scale. It's a sliding scale. All Einstein did was validate ancient spiritual teachings. It's, it's, it's so ancient. It's even in hermetic philosophy, they call it the law of gender, right? And they're not talking about biological sex. And ancient hermetic philosophy is clear that they're not talking about that. They're talking about the concept of duality. They call it the law of gender. This duality is engendered in things. Okay, that's, that's what they mean by that word. So, you are your twin flame, but at the level of the mind, you are polarized. The mind is also duality, right? The mind is also duality. I like it, I don't like it. I feel good, I feel bad. Um, it, it's, it's correct, it's incorrect. It's, it's uh, a positive, negative. It's past, it's future. It's me, it's them. Right. So separation consciousness, that's where you look at your twin flame and you go, there's two of us. There's me and there's them and we are separate. That's where that word came from, guys. That's not a twin flame word. That's an ancient Zen spiritualism word. Again, go to the homepage of this channel and watch my video called Twin Flames, Separation Consciousness, Unity Consciousness, Union, and detaching. You are your twin flame. You just got to remember that, guys. You literally are them. Okay. Eight of swords, five of cups. <laughs> I mean, do I really need to explain that? Guys, that situation is cooked. And divine masculine, oh, they feel kind of shitty. <sighs> that karmic situation is cooked. They feel trapped, but it's over. They realize even though they feel trapped, it's all in their mind. All they got to do is walk away. Now, the worst part about this, again, and this is why, like the moon, they don't have all the answers, but the underlying theme here, and again, the chariot, the, the chariot is what is alluding to that energetically, okay? The underlying theme is, how am I going to explain myself to divine feminine? You, to you, right? How am I going to explain myself to her, him? You, you could be like me, so-called divine feminine, it's really just energy, right? Yang or yin, or I think it's yang. How am I going to explain myself? I'm kind of a dumbass. I feel like a dope. <laughs> Oops. I kind of broke their heart. I'm going to have to have some excuses, but at least they're feeling some remorse. I mean, that's this five of cups. It's this deep loss and then compounded with this eight of swords and then the chariot over here for your connecting energy. Yeah, dude, they're really kind of focusing on you. Again, they might not be talking about it. They could be hiding their feelings. You know, they're embarrassed, they're ashamed, you know, whatever. Uh, we don't enjoy watching other people suffer, but I don't know, man. It's just what Divine Masculine is doing right now. They're gonna come back and make apologies to you. This is what I'm saying. It's gonna be quick too. We're talking a few weeks, dude. So Divine Feminine, you got to start working on this shit. And what is the work? Remembering who you are. That's all this is, guys. You are consciousness. You are your twin flame. Now, what I'd love to hear from you on today in the comments section below is, tell me your story. Seriously, I do read your comments. How have you noticed divine masculine changing and when? Because I'll tell you what, when you have these deeper spiritual realizations, that's when they come back. 
That's when they unblock you. You are your twin flame. It's spiritual. You are one spirit. You are one soul. You and your twin flame are one soul in two bodies, right? Capiche? Right. Okay. So divine feminine, this is all starting to click with you, isn't it? And I'd be, I'd love to hear from you on this too. How is this all adding up in your life? You're looking to the future and you're realizing, wait, this is for my highest good. This is the best thing for me. This could be the best thing that's ever happened to me. Yeah, you're right about that, Divine Feminine. You've got this like nagging suspicion, this underlying knowing that you can't put your finger on that your life is about to change, right? That's your soul. That feeling that your life is going to, that weird knowing that can't be explained, that is your soul. It's energetic, guys. You can't, you don't need to think about it. You don't need to understand it. And you can't actually, because consciousness and thought are like oil and water, guys. Okay. Now, thought comes from consciousness, but the mind says it works the other way around. We've been conditioned to think that we need to understand consciousness. And the funny thing is, it's not really you that's doing the thinking. <laughs> your consciousness, you're not a thinker. That's your soul, guys. I'm giving you the keys to the kingdom here, Divine Feminine. You are your twin flame. This is how you do the shit. This is how you do the work, man. You absolutely have the power to get your twin flame to unblock you and start talking to you because you, you are them. You literally are them. Guys, oh my God, this is so gosh darn fantastic. You can get 25% off my paid coaching right now. All you got to do, go to my website. And when you pay in full for my world-class Twin Flame Coaching or Law of Attraction Coaching programs, pay in full, use this coupon code at the checkout, get 25% off, guys. It's so shit hot. Right now, this is good through February 15th. So I'm giving you one day beyond Valentine's Day. This is for Valentine's Day. Use this coupon code LOVE25. I love you, Divine Masculine. I love you too, Divine Feminine. Yeah. All right. Let's make a baby. Let's make a baby. Really though, there's my free coaching videos. You don't even have to give me any money. You got two weeks, guys. Or a week. I don't know. What, what is today? The third? Fourth? I don't know. Guys, go check out my free coaching videos all over my YouTube channel. If you're not sure about all this, and but you're like, oh, I want to take advantage of that special, that coupon code. Right. Go watch my free shit. Go check it out. You're going you're gonna to see that my core message is different. And uh, there's a reason that I've been so able to help so many of you wonderful, freaking, stupendous guys. I love you guys. Seriously. This is the best thing that's ever happened to you. Go watch my free coaching videos or just sign up. Just sign up for my coaching. It's not expensive, guys. It's already not thousands of dollars. I'm never going to do that, guys, for my Twin Flame coaching. I'm thinking about raising the price for my Law of Attraction coaching, right? I might actually do that this spring. But my Twin Flame coaching, no way, dude. You guys are in so much agony. I can't do that. And I don't need to do that, guys. It's affordable, and it's going to stay that way. And right now, you can save another 25% on the introduction to the journey for Twin Flames. You can sign up for my Manifest Your Dream Life Law of Attraction coaching program. Don't sign up for that to get your twin flame back, though. It, it'll backfire. J trust me. <laughs> it's, it's, sign up if you want a soulmate or some money or something, right? Manifest Your Dream Life. Otherwise, I'm going to assume this is a twin flame tarot reading. Most of you are going to want the twin flame coaching. Yeah, that's the introduction to the journey. Eight and a half hour long instructional video program. I'll give you action steps you can implement right now to shut down the obsessive thinking and shift energetically into your soul, which is your twin flame. I also have payment plans. If you can't afford my already low prices, guys, no problem. I got payment plans. You can start for like 65, 75 bucks. It depends on which package you get. Six payments of, around, let's just call it around $70. And you get instant access to the videos uh, with your first payment. Now, the discount, it is available right now through the day after Valentine's Day. It's already not a lot of money. It's like 400 bucks or something. Take 25% off of that, guys. You're in. You're in with that coupon code. Now, when you're done watching the videos, you and I get to talk either in a one-on-one -on -one or in a group setting on my Get Your Twin Flame Spiritual Coaching calls, up to four calls a week. Guys, guys. Are you kidding me right now? That's like eight hours of live coaching every week. Every single week, eight hours of live coaching. You can talk directly to us 
There's myself. There's my coaches that are assisting me. There's a community on Facebook. It's a secret Facebook group, not my public New World All-Star group, but the private Facebook group for paying students. Nobody can see who, you, who is in there or what we're doing in there. Your associates, your boss, your spouse, <laughs> right? <laughs> I, I know how that goes, guys. It's all good. It's all good. Nobody can see what we're doing in there. It's a community, 350 people in there right now. You can tag us, ask us your questions any time of the day from anywhere in the world. You can reach us and you're going to get the correct answer, guys, and you're going to get results. Why? Because we're not asleep at the wheel. I'm not just going to take your money and be like, see ya. No, we're working, guys. We get out of bed every day and we work. I run this like a business, right? And I mean, in a good way, you're going to get what you paid for. You give me money, I give you some service. That's the way this works, guys, at New World All-Star. And it's actually Twin Flame Coaching. I'm just saying. It's, it's not soulmate coaching with the label Twin Flame on it. No healing, no clearing karma. No, you don't need to do that stuff, guys. You don't need to do that stuff. I'm not saying that's bad. That's just not what this is. This is pure consciousness. This is soul only. There's no mental gymnastics necessary uh, to get your soul to come back. I mean, your twin flame. It's all soul stuff. It's all consciousness. I'll show you the ropes and uh, you'll start having those breakthroughs, guys. So sign up today. Let's see what we got for the twin flame collective today. What you got? What you got? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, hold up. It's a sparky one. Oh, yep, it's that one. It's a sparky one. What do we got? What do we got? Trust. Guys, I don't even need to read out of the book on this one. We just did a whole ditty about this for the first 20 minutes of this video. Uh, well, maybe not 20 minutes, but I don't know, 10, 12 minutes. Guys, surrender. Surrender is where you stop resisting these changes. You're, and I'm not saying you don't have to make decisions and think about some of the things, but you're being pulled into a new way of life, guys. That's what's going on. You're being pulled into a new way of life, and that's perfectly all right. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay? So just chill. You, you got this, all right? And actually, it's, it's God. It's the universe. It's the all. You're good. You got this. You're being cared for, Divine Feminine. The star in reverse in the subconscious for Divine Masculine. Three of Wands in reverse next to Judgment. Yeah, pretty much, dude. Divine Masculine, Audi 5000. Audi 5000. No more limiting self-talk. No more of these tired old beliefs about I can't have the best thing for my life. And again, plot it. Like, how am I going to explain this to Divine Feminine? I was kind of a shithead. I ran away. I kind of did you wrong. What am I going to tell her? Right? Kind of like that. And this is this, like, the reason this star is, is a reversal is because Divine Masculine, they're kind of in that weird zone today. And this will change in a week or two. And I can tell that it's going to change because of that eight of wands. But it's this weird zone of, I got to make up for this. How am I going to explain this? I kind of make it a mistake. There's no mistakes, but that's just kind of the way Divine Masculine feels about it. For you, kind of a different story in the near future. The High Priestess in your subconscious letting go of all that limiting self-talk. Divine Feminine, all of it. That's why it's the High Priestess, because this is coming from within you, and you feel that, all right? The world next to the Seven of Swords in reverse, right. Exactly. Guys, all of that limiting self-talk, all of these ideas that you're anything other than absolutely unlimited, absolutely terrific and beautiful, and you're just gonna know it. You don't need to explain it. It's just what you are at your very core, consciousness, love. That's a beautiful thing. Guys, what a great reading. Oh my God, thank you so much for watching. Please give me a like. Also, please don't forget to hit the bell notification icon button when you subscribe. Because if you don't hit the bell button when you subscribe, you will not get notifications. Whenever I post one of my awesome videos, I'll be back tomorrow for Divine Masculine. Have a great Friday, guys. Bye.